Hello, Peggy here. Well, this is my hat. I've got it done. As you can see, I've used a lot of Tim Holtz die cuts. This is the clock, and i got a little bling there in the middle. I'm going to try and zoom out just a little bit so you can see the whole picture. i got some lace trim there and some bling. This is one of the side views. There is the there's the those down there is what I um earrings that I took apart from Walmart and everything. My daughter's gonna turn it here for me. Hopefully it'll turn okay. This is the front of it. Let's see if I can zoom in here. This is the flower. I got that from Walmart. It was a barrette. I took it apart and then put some gears behind it. And that little flower over there, I don't know if you can see it. That's one of those um, flower petals that I got from my winnings from Discount Paper Crafts. And at the top of it, I'll have to wait on that one. Okay, turn it for me. This is the other side. You can see I did the part there with the earrings again. I just put some chain, attached some chain. Then there's, um, there's that flower better. Then there's the keyhole and the keys that I'm cutting and then put some of the little um, gems on the holes there. And if you'll turn it again, you know I keep zooming and zooming. This is the back of it. That's a feather brit, peacock feather, that I got from Walmart. And I took it apart and attached it there. And then there's some more flower, flower petals that I got from Discount Paper Crafts, I believe. And then um, a little earring that I took apart, put it in the middle. There's some of the aluminum that I got from Michael's. And that's a dress form die cut that I cut out, put the wings attached, everything together. And then, you know, I got that's the bling that I put, I just kind of put it all together. Went all the way down with some other fibers too. And then that's the tool that I made into a bow. Then, if I can get her to kind of take it off and show the top of it, we'll do that. That's the top of it. Let's see if I can get in here. It's another one of Tim Holtz dies. And then I use my texture paste on parts of it just here and there. And then those are some, some black flowers that I got from the Dollar Tree at Halloween time. That is my steampunk hat. Turn it to the side again. I hope you like it. I had a lot of fun making it. It took me a couple weeks. But that is, that is it. Thank you for watching.